Howdy, I'm Vinny. Did you hire her to sleep with her? What? Why, I got a clock and she don't. She's doing the movies. Now you're just dropping the girls off of one of the parlors and killing time. We become an extraneous in a situation. That guy's the new CEO. Captain McDonough wants a tour of the precinct. Why am I giving you this tour? You are probably on the outside enough to be trusted. I want the truth. You on the pill because the guys are his condoms. Yeah, we do. You ready for makeup? Yeah. It really requires a lot of bravery to be able to get out there and do these kinds of things without it being, quote, sexy, without you looking good. It's saying, OK, now you've got your face between her legs, and then you lift this leg, and you show this, but you don't show that. I mean, it's not about sensuality. The more you immerse yourself in the business side of it, on every aspect, it gets down to uh, choreography. Yeah, enough, enough of that. There's gonna be real money in it now. Imagine watching a movie with American girls without any hassle from the war. The Mafia had their hands in everything from the labs to the distribution to the exhibition, all the way down the line. They were everywhere. The mob was at the height of its power. The peep shows, the porno shops, and stuff like that. If you're making money, then everybody's happy. It's like any other business. It's, it's, it's commerce, it's the supply and demand. If you understand your role and everyone else's role, it's an interesting world. It's about to be the movies or the whole house. It never trickled down to the girls. You know, the, the people at the bottom never really profit from this. And yet, pornography and the prostitution business could not exist without these women.